TSMC founder Morris Chang took aim at Intel CEO Pat Gelsinger on Tuesday, calling him, quote, very discourteous. At a Taipei Tech Forum, Chang shared his mixed reaction to an encounter with Gelsinger from five years ago. He also weighed in on Washington's plan to create a complete semiconductor supply chain, saying that it would be expensive and perhaps impossible. TSMC founder Morris Chang and his wife Sophie Chang enter the venue hand in hand. The occasion is the 20th anniversary of the Monte Jade Science and Technology Association of Taiwan. Chang gave a talk on growth as a business leader. For the first time, he spoke about the business strategy that he set for TSMC more than 23 years ago. It's been more than 20 years, so now I can make it public. Back then, it was a company secret. Chang revealed the goals he set for TSMC 23 years earlier. He intended for TSMC to gain a market edge through technical quality, reliability, and marketing. Over the years, the only goal not met has been offering low prices. At the forum, Chang also spoke about his interactions with Pat Gelsinger, CEO of Intel. I've met every one of Intel CEOs, including that fellow. Five years ago, that fellow was already a bit cocky. Today, he is very discourteous toward TSMC. I deal with him the way he deals with us. Chang revealed that five years ago, Gelsinger was CEO of a company called VMware and had visited him in Taiwan. Chang said Gelsinger had impressed him in the short space of 15 minutes. I asked him what kind of company VMware was, because I really didn't know. In just 15 minutes, he told me and explained VMware to me. He explained it very well. I thought, this fellow is talented. Cheng said Intel should not be underestimated, but he said the U.S. will have a hard time building its domestic supply chain for semiconductors. not going to be possible to turn back the clock. And uh, if you want to re-establish a complete supply chain, semiconductor supply chain in the United States, you will not find that to be a possible task. That has been the case up until now, and even more so now. That is to say, everyone wants TSMC. Will the shortages end soon? I think they'll eventually be resolved in the end, but I don't know when that will be. Speaking at a TSMC Sports Day two years ago, Chang predicted that the company would gain global geostrategic importance. Now retired, Chang is as confident as ever that the firm he founded will continue to be the bulwark of Taiwan's economy.